Honorable <coughs> Vice Chancellor Dr. Sanjay Deshmukh, my colleague, Additional Chief Secretary, Shri Sumit Malik, His Excellency Consul General of China, Mr. Sudhendra Kulkarni, and all the distinguished ladies and gentlemen present in the hall. I came to know about this center from Sudhendra ji when he came to me a few days back <clears throat> and said that uh, there's a proposal to have a MOU between this center and Mahatma Gandhi Center in the University of Pudan. That is when he also told me that G. Shingpin was also a great Indologist and that he had extensively studied Sanskrit and various other literature of India. The entire idea looked very exciting to me and I was hoping that very soon there would be a visit of Honorable Chief Minister to Shanghai, to Fudan University, where this signing of MOU would come through. In fact, it was a part of the same exercise of processing that MOU that we decided to come and visit this center and see for ourselves the activities that are going on here and see how the MOU will benefit both a Mumbai University as well as Fudan University. But I learned that uh, that event will happen a bit later uh, in time not immediately, but nevertheless that has given us an opportunity to visit this center and see for ourselves the kind of activities that are going on here, the possibilities that are being created for study by Indians about China and by Chinese people about India. The more people study, the more people go from one place to another, stay in those countries, the more there will be understanding uh, between the two countries and the peoples of the two countries. We have just now seen Milky Jain's experience in China. I think more such students going to Chinese universities and many more from China coming to India, they will carry better uh, understanding of these two countries, they'll go back to their hometowns, their home countries and tell their friends and family their experiences like just now we have seen. I think she has had a fantastic experience in China and that would encourage many more parents to send their children to study there and the same would happen if Chinese children and students study here and take back good experiences to China. I think building bonds through education, through learning, through staying in different countries, that will establish much better understanding and probably also help to deal with uh, some uh, issues that remain between the countries, but deal with them more maturely, with more interaction, with more compassion towards each other. So I think it is a very good idea that the two centers, one in Mumbai and one in Fudan University, are planning to enter into a MOU for sharing knowledge and sharing research, sharing academic activities. We have just now discussed with Honorable Vice Chancellor that the proposal for MOU will be processed very soon in the various academic bodies of this university. And once our additional chief secretary gives his stamp of approval to it, it will be ready for signing as and when that event is uh, organized. So with these words, I, I wish this center all the success and also wish that very soon we will have the MOU that will improve the academic activity, research and understanding 
between the two countries. Thank you. Thank you very much, Shrikun.